what's going on guys to voice Chevy and plays here and welcome back to another video and today we are going to experience Kamashita's change of heart if you guys are cool and down with that everybody get ram buckle up because here we go keep in mind I just literally woke up so I probably won't be as energized right now uh, <laughs> uh, man no nah, we're just hey we're just gonna head there I think we're just gonna head home and, and of course read because that's a that's all basically I can do will be will we able to spend time with Sergio uh oh come on no no just no oh <laughs> uh, yeah let's just spend some time reading um Um, proficiency. Make sure you close up. All right, I'm headed home. All right. <clears throat> the secret of the luck in, in a peer in a serene heart. Mm. Huh. Is this book about cleaning or is it training you to become a monk? Hmm, I didn't realize you've been reading that long. How far did you get? Not very far, my god. You know this. You still have some pages left. We should continue up some other time. Yep. Man. <laughs> okay, one more day, baby. One more freaking day. No wonder Wayne is so boring. I wonder what Ryuji and the rest is up to. That reminds me, yeah, 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 they pro that little sh the little crappy TV program. Let me check my DMs. Um, you know what? Got plans today? I can't just sit around and do nothing. I'm not the Arcadis Bridge if anything comes up. Um, let's go. Let's go meet my boy, Ryuji. And see, will you hang out with us? Oh. All right, hey. I think it's gonna be a spend time event. Yeah, it's gonna be a spend time event. Ah, fuck it. Let's go. <clears throat> yep. <clears throat> yep, it's a spend time event, but uh, at least anything to fly about. Ryuji seems satisfied. I think I had a pretty fulfilling workout. Yep. I feel like my bomb with Ryuji will grow sooner. Yep. Yes, sir. Hey. Uh, tomorrow's the board meeting. Don't worry. I'm sure the, cha the hot change of heart work. <clears throat> yep. The board meeting's tomorrow, right? We're gonna go and expel it if Kamishita doesn't have a change of heart by then. I'm sure he will. It definitely changed, but the real problem is for us if he didn't. You're right. <laughs> it's too early to give up by now. I guess we're gonna have to, gonna have to long way to find out tomorrow. We just gotta brace ourselves for all the possibilities. I'm sorry I changed off on more reassurance, but he should have the change of heart. Next. Just believe in that while we wait for tomorrow. Yep. Well, ah, the TV! Okay, whatever. We're, we're reading. We're reading. We're gonna spend some time reading. Yep, and we're gonna finish that book. Alright, I'm heading home. Alright. Gas upon your clutter with a heart detached from desire. The answer will come to you. Hmm. Okay. And we're gonna finish that book no matter what. So, well, you finish reading The Tidying of the Heart. Cleaning is a way to speak to your heart. I never thought of it that way. Reading books must have taught you how to become complicated and more efficient, huh? Yep. Okay, I think in this episode we might get these stats up. It might. But, uh, alright. Here we go. Here we go, guys. The ultimate moment of truth. Does Kamashita have a change of heart? This is no good. 
Uh, why? They're gonna give us a day off too. We have the week, rest of the week starting tomorrow. Yeah, it's ridiculous. Speaking of, what's up with that con card? The one that sent to Kamishita? <sighs> I didn't say anything about stealing desires or something like that. Yeah, something like that. I'm sure it's just a prank. No one's taking it seriously. Oh yeah, oh, I think we did it guys. I hope we did, but I think we didn't. <laughs> but who knows, we're about to see right here, right now. What's with the sudden morning assembly? I bet it's about that girl that jumped the other day. They don't have to tell us not to commit suicide. There was that weird calling card too, so I guess the teachers are freaking out. We're lucky that morning practice got canceled though. I feel like I'm gonna faint if this takes forever. <sighs> Oh boy. Shit. I have been born. born. That, that is, is why, why I will confess, confess everything, everything to you all. Oh. Oh shit. Huh? What's wrong with Mr. Kamoshiba? What's this about? Did the volleyball team do something? I have repeatedly done things that were unbecoming of a teacher. Yep, you better say it. Oh, you better spit it. Oh, boy. Verbally abusing students. Yeah, I'm calling you boy because you got your ass beat. <laughs> sexually harassing female students. Oh, yep. You better commit. You better confess your sins. Say everything and everything. Don't get on your knees, boy. Stand up. <laughs> I thought of this school as my own castle. There were even students that I sentenced to expulsion simply because I didn't like them. I will, of course, rescind those. Yeah, you better. You better. Let's go. Yes, sir. I am truly sorry. We're putting innocent youth through such horrible acts. Yep. I am an arrogant, shallow, and shameful person. No, I'm worse than that. You're a bubble gum, dumb, dumb, oodle spaghetti noodle, heaven ass nigga that has no life. You're a fucking pedophile. I feel to take responsibility. I kill myself for it. Did you just see that? Mr. Kamashita, please get off the stage for now. Everyone, return to your classes. Yep. Don't run, you bastard. Yep. She's still alive, even after all the things that made her want to die. You have no right to run from this. Tell him, on. Tell him. You're right. I should be punished under the law and atone for my crimes. I did horrible things to Takamaki-san as well, in return for giving Suzui-san a position on the team. I I tried to force her into having relations. Yep. 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 Keep it coming. As of today, I will resign from my position as an instructor. And turn, and turn myself, myself in. in. Yep. Someone, Someone please, please call, call the police. police. The police? He's a real. He's gonna get arrested. Ah. Damn. <laughs> this morning assembly is over. Return to your classes immediately. Shut your ass up. Thing got that drip with that suit and tie. Boy, you got those little Yeezys. <laughs> is this just like what that calling card said? Does this mean the Phantom Thieves thing was for real? 
Yep. Was something done to Kamoshida? Uh -huh. There's no way he'd steal someone's heart. <laughs> but why else would he start saying things like he'll kill himself or turn himself in? Maybe because it almost got leaked? Don't it go easier on you if you turn yourself in? I wonder what happened. Who knows? But man, Kamoshida turned out to be one sick bastard. Facts. Return to your classrooms at once. <laughs> I hate. I really hate teachers. I really did. Yep. Let's go. But was this really for the best? I think so. Yeah, it's gotta be. Mm -hmm. It's happening way too fast. Huh? What the? Mishima? Takamaki san. I'm sorry. Huh? We all knew, but we pretended we didn't. Takamaki san, I had you all wrong. I'm sorry that I spread rumors about you. Better be. I didn't know at all. Kamashi was forced to be pushing himself on you. It must have been so hard for you. I'm sure there's a ton of people who want to apologize to you. Hmm, not a paparazzi full of them. We're so sorry. No, it's okay. The same goes for me, too. Besides, that's all in the past now. Hey, you there! Return to class at once! Boy, you get to class! Well, see you later then. Apologize enough for what I did to you. I swear I'll make it up to you someday. Uh, you're cool, dude. You will. Looks like Kamoshida ain't the only one that had a change of heart. Man, I'm glad for you. Looks like those weird rumors are gonna go away. Yep. My thing doesn't really matter. We made Kamoshida apologize about Shiho. That's more than enough for me. You should hurry and tell her about it. Yep. Yeah. Man, we did it. We did it, lads. We did it. Holy shit. I totally freaked out. He really did have a change of heart. We did it, lads. <clears throat> and we were lucky his mind didn't get messed up either. <laughs> this was an A-plus job. Yep. Does this mean that they won't have a mental shutdown even if their powers disappears? I see. So we need to persuade the shadow without killing it, and then send it back to its real self. Uh -huh. Our targets won't undergo a cognitive collapse if we do that. Yep. So we can get him to confess with no bad stuff? Hey, that works for me. Yep. Do you have to be so loud? Eh, don't worry about it. So, how'd it go? With Shiho, I mean. She's regained consciousness. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It was only for a little bit, but I got to talk to her. Huh. I was able to tell her that Kamoshida admitted to what he did. Shiho. She told me she was sorry. Looks like she found out that I was flirting with Kamoshida for her sake. Here I was, wanting to apologize to her. Kamoshida's at fault for all this. Yep. I know. Shiho's mom is thinking of transferring her to another school after she recovers. The whole sexual harassment and attempted suicide. People will label her after that. Sounded like Shiho had the same idea too. Ah, it's gonna get lonely. I hope we get more friends. Or Phantom Thieves members. She's alive. You can see her anytime. Oh, I'm sorry. It's only like nine in the morning. That aside, how 
was surprised you could hold yourself back against Kamoshida's shadow. It wasn't like that. I just wanted Kamoshida to apologize himself. You're so kind, Lady On. No matter how much of a shitbag he was, finishing him off would have left a bad aftertaste, huh? Yeah. <coughs> That's not it. Pause. I think revenge is better served if I make him repent. Realizing what he's done, he'll grovel for forgiveness the rest of his life. You know? I just believe there are fates worse than death. <coughs> mm-hmm. Holy shit. <laughs> I mean, she ain't wrong. Uh, anyways, that's all settled. But you know, there was one more thing I was wondering about that castle. Why was Kamoshida the only one who had that metaverse thing? It isn't necessarily limited to him. What? It's something anyone could have if their heart became warped from their desires. Huh. Anyone. Anyone. Wanna check it out? Not right now. We better lay low for a while. People are still gonna be talking about Kamoshida. Mm -hmm. Then again, it's totally impossible for someone to find out what we did at this palace. Yeah, about that? Weird rumors about you guys are already going around. Stuff like you got together and threatened Kamoshida with something close to physical violence. Um. <laughs> the hell? Um. People aren't going to easily believe that phantom thieves really exist. Uh -huh. Calling cards being treated like it was a prank by someone who knew what Kamoshida was doing. Hmm. Makes sense. We're the ones who did it. I still don't completely believe it myself. Yeah. Let's wait for things to settle down for the time being. Anyways, let's check how much this metal can be sold for. It'd be better if we pawned it off ASAP. Yep. Ooh, got a hit! Wait, wait, 30,000 yen? That's all a gold medal's worth? Remember that time in middle school? I lent you some money. No. There's no way I borrowed 30,000 yen from you. Wouldn't it be around that much with compounded interest? No. <laughs> interest my ass. I'm not saying that I'm taking all of it. I mean, it's your fault for not paying me back all these years. It's just common sense. What are y'all talking about? I agree I'm laying low and keeping an eye on this situation. However, you dragged me into this. It would be nonsense not to celebrate a successful mission. I guess we could blow this dirty money on something fun. Yep. Discussions among phantom thieves are to take place over luxurious food. How about it? Not a bad idea, Morgana. Hey, wait! Ah, uh, I guess it's fine. There's somewhere I want to go then. Like where? It's a place Shiho and I have been wanting to go for a while. I owe money, so I can't complain. You good with that? Whoo, fine by me, buddy. <laughs> I'll leave it to your discretion as well, Lady On. I'll call and check the prices later then. Yep. When should we go? Wanna do it soon, like tomorrow? Why don't we go on the last day of the holidays? Alright, that sounds cool. It'll help energize us when school life starts up again the day after. <laughs> I hate when people say that. It'll energize when school comes back up. Hmm. Like, bruh. It won't energize me for shit. Then, uh, the fifth. On Children's Day. Okay. So, who's going to sell this? Leave that to us. We know a store that'll buy anything. Don't we? Yep. Okay, okay, I'll leave that to you guys. Mm-hmm. Alright. We finally got that shit out of the way. 
It is that called Metal Wheel? When do we get inside his palace? No, that one is a fake. It's just a byproduct of his cognition. The real metal should still be in his possession. Uh, Kamashiro size the real one. You telling me Kamashiro still got that gold medal? Who cares? What matters if we change your heart? Anyways, if we have taken that real thing, that would be stealing. I, I, I don't think he'll be proud of that medal anymore regardless. Huh. You, you like all pretty easy stuff, huh? You wanna forget my debt? That's different. 500 yen is a lot of money for your middle schooler, you know? D do you still even have that dolphin anyways? Bro, what are y'all talking about? Stop digging that up. Back in middle school, we went to the field trip to the aquarium. Where Yuji spent all his money on souvenirs, and I lent him some of the train fare. I'm sorry, that was for my mom. Well, well, I guess we could call it even now, after all we've been through. Thank you. Anyways, we don't gotta worry about selling that medal if it's all fake. End of story. Kamashita will never be proud of that once in a lifetime gold medal ever again. Depending on how you look at it, that punishment might be even worse than death for him. Yep. I'm gonna start in the mall. I'm gonna have some lost time off. Must be nice. For me, it means more customers. Well, sucks to be you. Ah! All right. So, what are we gonna do here? Oh, I guess we'll do another crossword. Uh, let's play a little. Boom, and then bop, pow, blossom. <clears throat> Known as the flower watching in English. How many is the old Japanese tradition for blooming blo blo cherry blossoms and enjoy the arrival of spring? The flower is mentioned in the traditional Japanese poetry actually refers to the palm flower. It's actually cherry because the overtook of the usage of the Harion period. All right. Huh, I can even figure that out. Yep, and we got that down. Boom. And I think uh, do we do some more read? Yeah, let's let's do some more reading. Um Uh, yeah, let's just do some reading. Let's, let's um, Yoka Rocker. Hmm. This book talks about Yoga Jai, right? Hmm. You already know this, are you, don't you? It's poisonous to read that. <clears throat> Alright, so that we got that down. Um, <clears throat> yeah, actually, let's just make some coffee. <clears throat> Trying to make some coffee? Yep, I'll brew some. Hey, looks like you're starting to get interested in this, huh? Hey, you're not up to it trying to push me, are you? Huh? I'm gonna go get some cigs. Go buy your cancer stick, Sergio. We don't care. I just want some coffee. Oh, I love that smell of good coffee. Yes. All right. The way you're drinking that makes it more delicious. Yep, two more of coffee and then that should go up our charm yeah charm i feel like we're gonna get rank three already in in terms of charm <laughs> huh, looks like you added again huh how's it going here let me have a sip the mm. yeah, acidity this must be gilliman s a s SHB. Alright. The volcan the volcanic soil of Guatemala is an ideal for great going coffee. Guatemalan beans is ranked as the altitude of cultivation. Strictly hard bean is a grade given coffee ground altitudes above four hundred four forty five hundred feet. It has currency, SED, and, and a full body. Mm -hmm. The profile is bland. You should, you should practice more to bring out the roast. But although I see you're preparing the cup, I acknowledge your hard work. You still have a lot to learn about the coffee and be patient. 
Yep. <clears throat> and we should rest now because we have a big day tomorrow. We literally just had it. It's not big anymore. God, my God. Jesus H. Christ. <laughs> okay. Alright, today we're gonna pawned off that metal metal. Hey, can you hear me? If you don't have times, come help me out instead of sleeping your life away. Do we owe it to him? We'll just have to wait. Hurry down and help him. No kip. Sorry, I kinda of pressured you into doing this. No problem. And now to our next topic. Fall from Grace, the story of a dishonored Olympic medalist. Just recently, a high school coach confessed as an assembly that he had been repeatedly abusing students. Given his prior Olympic achievements, this has caused quite a stir. What caused this habitual offender to suddenly confess these heinous crimes to his entire school? The police are hoping that the upcoming interrogations will bring light to this question. Isn't this... My friends would come back from practice with bruises uh, um. and tell them. It was scary, but I'm relieved that the abuse is finally going to end now. He would touch me and stuff all the time. I'm glad I didn't have to deal with that sexual harassment anymore. There were always rumors, sure. Not many people believed them, though. Like, I'm totally shocked they were actually true. At least now I can go to school without worrying. This is your school, isn't it? Seems like it. Uh, things might be getting turbulent at school, but you need to just keep your head down, all right? More importantly, keep those hands moving. I've got some more stuff I need you to do. Pause. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. The chief really worked us hard today. Uh, another conversation. Did you see it? It was on the news. There's no way the school is going to be played dumb after that. I saw it too. Shield's name didn't come up, right? Uh, not, not that I saw. I bet they want to keep that part quiet. I'm so glad. It's finally over then. All we gotta do is... Is stuff our faces and put this common sheet of crap behind us. I'm totally looking forward to this celebration party. I'll try not to let you guys down. Yes. Alright. We need to go sell that medal tomorrow. Even if the chief wants some wants us to help. Just turn him down, okay? Alright, fine. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Um anything else that we can do? Uh, um Actually, I think I should go out here. Hey, hey. Ah, fuck you, Morgana! Actually, let's let's just make some tools. Um, hmm. So, okay, I think we'll need. Yeah, we're gonna have to make some more stuff here so we're going to craft two go homes yet yes yeah and we rank up in proficiency baby let's go proficiency level 2 right. let's go all right man we've been working on we've been killing in our stats lately all right we're going to turn into metal. Make sure to do the dishes. Uh, I can't right now. Sorry. Uh, what? Welcome. Am I interrupting something? Not at all. Ah, nope, not at all. Miss. Miss, whoever your name is, you know you kind of looking cute, even though you're an adult. It's high. 
that the thing everyone's been talking about? Yeah. Doesn't this make you curious? People who were living normal lives suddenly went mad or deranged out of the blue. Not to mention that it's happening one after another. Could they really be coincidental? Maybe. Hmm. Leaving that aside, what do you have? Hmm. I'll have the house blend, please. Are you a part-timer? I'm surprised this place can afford one. Uh, no, not exactly. Are you a high school student? Where do you attend? Sujin. <laughs> oh, someone I know goes there as well. I've heard that things are rough right now. Mm-hmm. A teacher named Kamoshida confessed his crimes like he was a completely different person, supposedly. And it happened all of a sudden one day. Can a person's mental state change so easily? Huh. Is my drink ready yet? Nope. Coming right up. I think I'm just going to get out of here. <laughs> er, yep. Alright, today's the day we turn in that medal for cash. You uh -huh. have place that'll buy it off you, right? Yep. I know exactly where to freaking go. Central Street. <clears throat> and we're going to Untouchables, which is right here. Hmm? So, this is the place. Looks like it. Let's just go take care of this. Uh, we don't even have a search warrant yet. Just be patient. I'm sure we'll get one soon enough. I don't think they'll be running off near this alley. <laughs> well, whatever, I'm just gonna go in casually. Yo, Mr. EOI. How you doing, my guy? Or Shirley Manager. Um, I want you to buy this. Huh, a gold miner? Metal? Why did you have this? You don't buy any fakes or stolen goods here, kid. Hey. Hold on a second. Let me see. Hmm. Uh, I'm sure enough I'm not gonna ask where you got this. How's 300,000 yen? So, for it. Works for me, my guy. <clears throat> huh. 30,000 yen it is. And blam. Man, we're getting our bands up. <clears throat> we're banded it up right now. It's almost time. Hey, take this with you. Thanks for selling me that metal. Huh. But it's best not to bring it up and just next time, just come back and bring it over here. Got it. Huh. Glad you understand quickly. They're here. Huh. Mishiwa, Mishishiwa Iwa, yes. There's some matters you like to just discuss with you. Go, kid. <clears throat> uh, do you know why we're here? <sighs> oh no. Looking for evidence? Evidence? You tell me, Mr. Detective. Watch your attitude. Watch your attitude. <clears throat> Uh, what, are you just gonna search me? Come on, do what you gotta do, right? <clears throat> what was that? <clears throat> I'm gonna up to any citizen that's supposed to cooperate with the cops, right? Uh, hey, you understand that was the lead of legitimate, right? I could have sworn that it was. <laughs> Can you two hurry it up? I got a business to run here. You, you bastard. Hey, you. What's in that bag? Show me. The kid's just a regular old customer. You, you can check the tapes if that will convince you. They'll show everything that gone down here today. I don't want to be... I don't want to be here when the detectives to see the footage of me and they go metal. I should leave. I will not let you get away. Show us what's in the bag. None of your business. <laughs> I said, show it to me. Hey, you're talking to a kid, remember? Besides, he's not the only one we're here to see. Ugh. That's right, Mr. Detective. Maybe you should try not to harass my customers to see how that goes. Girl. 
Safe, safe trip home, kid. What were those detectives doing there? More importantly, aren't you curious about what's in the bag? Uh, maybe a little. Well, come on, let's open it up. Oh, real gun? Wait, I think it's just a model. It's incredible, though. Miles ahead of the one with Yuji had. There's something weird about that place. God. I just had a great idea. We should totally buy this gun from him later. I mean, it's perfect. Something this real looking would work wonders in the metaverse. <laughs> anyway, he told you to bring it back the next time you came, right? You right. Should try striking a deal with him when we go to the tournament. Yep. Paper bag. Even though it literally just peaked. <laughs> I'm a little divvy. Uh, I'm a little ballsy, alright? <clears throat> huh. Oh, it's calling me. Oh, hello. It's me. Ella. I saw the news. You know, about the Hamashita. Uh-huh. It's getting a lot of coverage. Serves them right. Uh. I don't think we did anything wrong though. Right. <clears throat> yeah. I'm sure we did. That's pretty amazing, huh? I didn't think we'd actually be able to do it. Wow. And yet, look at us now. This calls for a celebration. Let's meet in front of Shibuya Station at noon tomorrow. Don't be late. Oh, and All right. did you turn off that metal? You didn't forget, right? Right. I remembered. Oh hell yeah, I'ma go love it. <clears throat> yep. Ah, a restaurant of Lady Anne's choosing. Finally, a decent meal. What do you think they're gonna be eating? Uh. Mmm. Oh shit. Tuna, sea urchin, maybe even salmon roe. Oh. In any case, I'm sure we're looking forward to it. God, I'm so... Uh, I'm just so hungry, bro. Why are you making me hungry, Morgana? Like, 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 why? Why are you making me hungry? Alright, we can finally celebrate. Um... You know what, let's just... I think... Yeah, let's just do it right here, right now. Alright, we can probably make three. Good luck. Uh... Uh... Okay, we're gonna have to make like two lot picks. Yep. <clears throat> two lock picks, um and and we'll need common aroma and boom. All right. Yeah. And get two points of proficiency, even though we literally just leveled that crap up. Whoa. That doesn't matter. We move to the celebration, and it's gonna be cutscene heavy. So prepare yourselves. <clears throat> no wonder Lady Han chose this place. Right. <laughs> of course it's good. This is a famous hotel after all. Oh yeah, I heard that the police are coming to interview some people at school. What? That's troublesome. Our names are gonna come up for sure. People are spreading all sorts of rumors about us at Kamoshida. Right. I keep hearing stuff like the Phantom Thieves really stole this part. I think most people don't believe it, but some of them actually seem grateful. Yeah. Look at this. The Phantom Aficionado website? What? Well done, Phantom Thieves. 
Now I can keep going too. Thank you for giving us hope. Pretty cool, huh? Well, yeah. <clears throat> I was just oh. desperate to deal with my own problems, but seeing people saying all this feels strange. For real. Yeah. Hey, what do we do now? Um. Plan on eating? <laughs> Cause I'm starving. Of course I'm gonna eat, but. but... This place has a time limit. Oh crap! We only got an hour to eat. Oh crap! Just 50 minutes left. Oh, I'm not gonna finish all the beef dishes at this pace. I need to eat my way through the entire dessert menu. <laughs> we'll snack something for you guys too. Don't worry. Nah. Oh. oh man, God melts in my mouth. Seriously, only meat? Now where should I start? And she's all about the cake. So happy. Hey, hey, calories. <laughs> Beans. Beans? There were some pretty bizarre things there too. So we got you a variety of those fried bananas, preserved eggs, and some kind of beans. Beans. M more beans? Beans. Put some on the plate and got all mixed up. But it should probably still taste good. This is just plain grotesque. Let's go. Yep. These two just don't know what fine dining means. We'll show them. Yes, sir. Let's do it. That's reassuring. You guys watch our things while we're gone. Wait patiently for our return. Hmm. Oh, it's like a media explosion in my mouth. Pause. Oh, this hurts cream cheese. Not pause. I'd expect from the buffet at a top class hotel. Yep. The ingredients and variety of dishes are crazy good. There's a reason it costs 8,000 yen. Jesus Christ. They have a lot here, but fish should come first. Let's fill our plate with all sorts of fish. Which table do you think they're at? Yeah. I uh, believe the. F I believe the fish is over here. Or in the meat section. Wait, over here. Prefer it raw, but grilled is great too. Have you heard, my dear? The news about that Kamashita fellow was absolutely dreadful. Oh, right. That teacher at Shujun Academy caught doing such indecent acts. You're not British. You're not British, mate. You clankers are not British. You, you freaking snakes. <clears throat> Horrible psychotic breakdown episodes, have they? Oh, I wish they wouldn't let themselves be distracted by such a tawdry scandal. You're not British. <laughs> Perhaps it's a sign of how peaceful this country is. I honestly pity those poor Shujin students, though. Hmm. It sounds like the Kamashita incident is the talk of the town. Hmm. Shoot, they noticed you. Just grab some food and act natural. On the plus side. We'll get to eat the food later. How did a child like this end up in here? I what you say? hope you didn't bring friends. I prefer my meals to remain hooligan free. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, shut up, you little donkey. <coughs> Come, let us go. What's so bad about kids? I just found my inner coat and Rams the only crap. <laughs> People here are reacting to the news. Yeah. Maybe there are more people we can eavesdrop on at other tables. Yeah. Okay. 
Let's grab some meat. Let's grab some meat. <laughs> All right. The meat dishes are nearby. But this was the meat section, right? Right? Oh. All right. We'll just grab some here. Meat. I'm loving your cheap meal, meal is just not the same if you don't have any. I got distracted. When you really look at it, he's just an ex-athlete who overestimated himself. He should have just accepted his lot in life and quietly done his job as a teacher. It's not even an incident we can take seriously. The whole story is pretty ridiculous. We should probably look into it. But we can also just let the low-ranking scrubs handle it. Look into it? I guess they're investigating Kamoshida? They don't sound very enthusiastic about it, though. Hmm. Yeah, grab some food. It's <laughs> not too chatty. It's gonna be arriving soon. We don't want to keep him waiting, so we better get going too. <laughs> what is he going to discuss with the higher ups? Well, I'm sure it's more important than lunch. We were dressed quite well, but they still looked pretty shady to me. Yep. Hmm. I wonder how the other people here are reacting to the news. You're right. I think we're gonna grab some dessert. Oh, how close! It looks even bigger and more delicious. This is giant sweet. I got distracted. Brad, it's food. Let loose. News travels quick. It's already all over the internet. You know, the story about how Kamashita got his ass kicked by some world reforming heroes. It doesn't sound like a serious story to me. Some of the details are pretty far-fetched. Don't worry about it. We just have to do what they tell us to do. It's all rumors made up by school kids anyway. If it's gripping news, who cares if it's not true? So they don't believe themselves. If they're making up stories to make the Phantom Team seem real, means they're doing this in front of the actual Phantom Thieves. We're gonna shut up! Well, pack fast and get some food! And make sure it's got a lot of whipped cream! What's wrong? Ah, uh, nothing. I thought some weird kid was looking at us. That's all. Why don't we go? It's almost time for the meeting. Well, that was rude. Did you hear him? He said you were weird. I get that a lot. Hmm. No Unfortunately. <clears throat> Alright. And I think we gotta grab one more right here for the homie DJ Screw. Rice is incredible. It's the cornerstone of every great meal. Sorry, I got a bit carried away there. So the ratings for the news were really that good. It was because it was about that teacher who sexually harassed his student, huh? Was it Kamoshida? It's all about how you frame it. You've got to cater to the idiotic public. Ratings go up when you show them crude, sensational news and make it easy for them to understand. How can we be so insensitive? A student almost killed herself because of that Kamoshida. For real. By the way, do you think these sudden changes of heart might be real? Well, that's... Hmm? Quick, grab some food! Oh, and don't forget the crispy bits. So, because he had a sudden change of heart, he just confessed to all his crimes? <laughs> Who knows? Sorry, but it's time. I have to go. I'll call you again after the meeting. A sudden change of heart, huh? I suppose I can't blame him for seeing it that way. I don't think there's anyone else we can listen in on. But it's shocking. So many of the adults here don't seem like nice people. For real. Now, according to what we heard, it seems most adults aren't very interested in the news about Kamoshida. Well, now that we've got a nice variety of food on our plates, let's head back to the others. <coughs> yep, let's eat it up. <laughs> dang, dang, dang. You brought a ton back. What do you think about coming up against such ritzy food? I just want to eat. I just want to eat, man. I just, I'm just hungry. I was thinking that too, but take a bite. Using better ingredients makes stuff taste way different. 
Look at you, acting like you have a refined palate all of a sudden. Don't you think you're eating too much, Mona? Mm. There's no... No way when we'll get to come here again. Sure, but you guys brought back loads of food. It'd be a shame to let it all go to waste. Why don't you help them out, Ryuji? Well, we should both help. Oh, me? I'm way too stuffed. I couldn't possibly help. <laughs> yeah, stuff in your face with cake. Whatever. Let's deal with this ourselves. Yes, sir. <laughs> no matter how much we eat, it feels like the yeah, the amount of food stays the same. There's still more. Don't give up. Let's keep at it. Oh boy. <laughs> Damn. Uh, my belt feels like a multiple sizes too small. Oh yeah. This is a victory. For all of us. That was a braze. Oh, is your stomach the size of a freaking palace? <laughs> Good job, you guys. How about one last dish to cleanse your palate? I recommend the seasonal tart. The grapefruit has both alluring sweetness and a tangy sourness. Uh, stop. I don't want to hear about sour stuff. Uh, this is good. I gotta go to the bathroom. Well, we gotta take a shit. Well, me too. Please carry me gently. How the hell you're gonna shit? <laughs> My, look at that table. Come now, pay them no attention. I'm sure they must not normally have the chance to eat such exquisite food. I can only imagine what their parents must be like. What was that? We don't got time for that. Come on, let's go. Yep, let's go. Ugh, I'm stuffed. I totally panicked when I saw the closed for cleaning sign of the bathrooms. You were talking big about eating until you puked, but you really did puke. Are you some kind of moron? It same goes for you. What floor was that restaurant on? We came up to get here, so it has to be on a lower floor, right? Oh no. Hey yo! Oh, oh no! What the There's still no update on the case. What? Not yet. Hey, excuse me, but why are you still involved? It's not something you should be concerned with. I don't care about your opinion, you incompetent buffoon. When I say take up the pace, you do it. Hey, you're cutting in line. What do you want? We were here first. Uh, I, no, come on. Apologize. What? what do you ah! Let me say it, please. We're in a hurry. Oh, I'm sorry. So you can butt in front of other people if you're in a hurry? It seems the customer base has changed since I was here last. Have they started a daycare? The fuck you say to me? What? Sir, we don't have time for this. I know. Don't bother with them. That voice just now. Oh no. Piles with that bossy guy. Shouldn't we head back down? Yeah, but that dick really pissed me off. He wasn't even hiding the fact that he looks down on everyone. Don't lose your temper over this. I just can't forgive shitty adults like that. For real. That man's voice. It's, it almost sounds like the one from back then. What's wrong? Uh, 
It's a bit light headed. You not feeling good? He almost never eats well after all. Plus, I'm always stuck eating canned cat food. Yeah, that sir bullshit makes me sick. Damn it! What took you so long? Are you all pissy? Sorry. I had a run in with some woman a second ago. She bumped into me, but then said it was all my fault when she dropped her plate. Sounds like a real bitch. Yeah. Thanks, though. Yeah. The restaurant workers all look at me with this disapproving expression. I wonder if we're out of place here. We're not. Hey Morgana. What is it? Anyone could have a palace, yeah? Anyone with a strong, distorted desire. Same for them having a change of heart if the treasure gets stolen. Right. That would be the case. Why are you bringing this up all of a sudden? We had trouble earlier too. These selfish shitheads who just look down on everyone else. I was just wondering if we'd be able to change those kinds of people too. <laughs> you mean, you want to continue as the Phantom Thieves? I've been thinking. We put a lot of work into changing Kamoshida's heart, but nobody believes in the Phantom Thieves. That's true. Plus, those guys who had no other choice but to just deal with it are thinking us. Us, of all people! What do you think, Odd? I... I agree. If we ignore people who are in trouble, I'd go back to being the same as I was before. Well, that's true. You're under my tutelage. There's nothing we can't accomplish as phantom thieves. Shouldn't we be able to help him out? Hmm. I didn't think we such a possibility. If this is true, with this power, we may be able to help people. But... That means we'll have to fight shadows again, doesn't it? Yep, I'm sure it'll be worth worth it. Yep. Uh, I'm sure we'll manage. Yep. <laughs> right. I want to help people. Even if you guys are still just fledglings, this means we're an actual organization now. Fledglings. <laughs> That's, actually That's actually pretty fitting, fitting for us. All right, it's settled. Yes, sir. We're gonna catch all these city adults by surprise and make ourselves known to the world. Are you okay being our leader? Hell yeah. No objections here. I can't handle all that responsibility stuff. Where's my say in this? But Lady Anne made the recommendation, so. I'll allow it. Well, should we decide on a name for our group? Yep. Yeah, I just went with Phantom Thieves of Hearts last time, but don't you think a real name would be cooler? Ooh, hmm. got it. I want to do something both cute and luxurious sounding. Okay. Let me see. How about the diamonds? You still as an Ariana. <coughs> Getting a real little league baseball feel from him. Well then, here's my suggestion. How about Tilefish Toilet? What? <laughs> That's what I ate earlier. It's commemorated now. Oh no, you idiot. You decide for us. Okay. Hmm. Your name may be visible to other players, so don't put a name that's considered offensive. Um. Got a good, 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 good name for us. Boom, bam, bop, and pow. 
the goats. We are the goats. No. We are the goats from now on. The goats. Yep, I'm finished that. Uh, 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 uh. Nope. It's astronomically good. A good name for a rookie. We going with that? Yep, the goats. Yep, if that's okay. Well, now that the name's set, who's our next target? We're going to have to wait on that, so. Tons of rotten adults and all. Why not just stick to targeting big names? Like a CEO? Yeah, something along those lines. If we go after some big wig, it's gotta get on the news, right? Yep. Don't you think more people would believe in us if we did that? Yep. That's not a bad idea. <laughs> really, Yuji. Sure. If we become better known, we might be able to give courage to a lot more people. I don't really like the idea of just picking someone out of the blue, though. Let's narrow it down to someone we can all agree on that. Yep. Hmm. So we need a big wig we decide on unanimously. I like that unanimous decision part. It's like we're making some kind of pact. Now then, this is the official formation of the Phantom Thieves organization. The goats, Morgana. We're the goats. Oh no! Our time for the buffet ran out. I guess we'll just have to talk more tomorrow. Yep. Oh boy. Another Psy event. Here we go. Another world in which people's distorted cognitions take shape? Stealing treasure to change hearts? Yep. And on top of that, a talking cat told you all this. Yes, it's all, it's all true. Honestly speaking, that all sounds absurd. It's hard to believe that this is even worth listening to. Still, it can't be considered nonsense when parts of it align with Kamoshida's confession. The same goes for the testimonies of the officers who arrested you. But so be it. At any rate, you mentioned something more important. These two other accomplices, besides this talking cat thing that appeared in your story. From what you've been telling me, they're students at the same school, aren't they? I'd rather not answer. Very well. I'll leave it at that. Let's continue on. The questioning's not over anyway. If you are making this up, the cracks in your story will prove it. The next to receive a calling card was this individual. Hmm. A master of Japanese arts, Ichiryusai Matarame. It's even more incomprehensible than Kamoshida as to why this man was targeted. Where did you come to know him? And how did you learn of his crimes when you weren't a victim of them? Start by telling me what you all schemed. No. Alright. And we officially enter a new arc within the story of Persona 5 Royal. Uh, we spent all of our money on that buffet, but... We established the fantasies, so that's all worth it. But yeah. Man. Yes, sir. The fantasies. I'm kind of like the sound of that. I really hope we can help people. I'm curious about the fishing on the website, though. I wonder who made it. No clue. More importantly, you see that survey on there? I don't know how I feel about it. Yeah, there's, there's like this approval rating thing. It's only... At like six <clears throat> percent that's better than I expected I guess it's not bad if you put it that way but I don't want to get don't just I don't you just want to get it higher than that but I, I bet it goes up top up a ton when we target bigger people it's pretty damn exciting if you try to think about it like that yeah you're actually right well let's try to keep breaking hard from this point on and we unlock the thieves then which will we'll go there in the future but that's going to do it for this episode of persona 5 royal 
and I hope you guys did enjoy if you did be sure to hit that like button comment and subscribe while notifications on YouTube t is telling me 98% of you are watching this video is not subscribed so I encourage you to subscribe right now to help me get to 500 subscribers on the channel and a in the next episode we'll continue on within the next arc within the story but I hope you guys did enjoy if you did like, comment, and subscribe. And it's your boy, Tavor Shepard, playing Sam. Peace out. Catch you guys here. Peace. Hey, guys. If you made it to the end of this video and you want to see more content in the future ASAP, hit the like button, comment to give me feedback and ideas, and subscribe, and click that bell to turn on all notifications on so you won't miss a single banger from your boy. And this is Tavor Shepard, playing Sam. Peace out. Catch you guys in the next video.